What's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Jolin. I'm in the studio about to get to work, but I just wanted to make a quick video on a topic that I seen over the weekend that had me looking at the rap game like, hmm? You feel me? Now, if you watch football, you know every, every year around this time, we kind of find out who's going to be performing at the halftime show. Uh, I think two years ago, we had Dre. Dre brought out Snoop. Snoop and them brought out M, and M decided to bring out Fifth. Now, that was a great performance. They turned up for the West Coast. Everybody was turned up. You feel me? Good show. Now, last year, I want to say Rihanna did it, and it was a great show. She came out. She let everybody know that she was pregnant and stuff. The, the media went crazy. You know what I mean? But this year, this year is a little bit different. Now, if you was on your Instagram or your Facebook or any type of social media, you probably seen who will be opening up for, for this year. Now, I'm not taking nothing away from this artist, but there's one artist in mind. When I think of New Orleans, which is where it's gonna be, who should be performing? I mean, there's a couple people, but there's one person in, in, in general that should be on that stage that night, that game, that time. It's, it, it's Wheezy Wee. It's Wheezy Wee. Now, we seen over the weekend that Kendrick Lamar is going to be uh, doing a halftime show for next year's Super Bowl, which is which is dope. You know what I mean? Like I said, I'm not taking nothing away from Kendrick at all. You feel me? But I do think that there's a little background to why this might have occurred or who thought about this and was really like New Orleans performance, the biggest show of the year. Who should perform? There's one dude in particular that 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 kind of called the shots on who's been performing these last couple years, and that's Hova. That's Jay, you know what I'm saying? Um, you already know that Wayne always has said uh Jay-Z was his favorite artist. That's his favorite rapper. I remember he said, if I didn't go to Cash Money, I was gonna go over there and sign with Jay. You know, back in the day, Rockefeller Records was they was them. You know what I mean? And since then, Jaden grew to be a, a businessman. You know what I mean? He's not so much in the rap game anymore, but you know, time and time again, he'll come out with some hits if he feel like it type shit. You know what I mean? But I'm just like, Jay is in charge of these performances. And I remember back in the day, if I'm not mistaken, Jay and Drake, they didn't, they didn't really see eye to eye. You know what I mean? So I'm just like, okay, okay, okay. That's, that's, that's Wayne's artist. We know that. You know what I mean? And you noticed that a couple months back, there was a song about Drake, and it was the hottest song on the market. It's still sweeping to this day. Not like us. You feel me? I'm sure you probably got it on your playlist and stuff like that. But Not Like Us was the biggest song of this year. Who sing that song? Kendrick Lamar. You feel me? Kendrick Lamar is he, he he's like a, a low key a low key celeb. He don't pop out looking all flashy. You don't see him you know doing a whole bunch of bullshit. Kendrick pop out. He let you see when he wants you to see him, and then he get back and he do whatever he do. We don't know what he do because he don't show us what we do, but that's cool. But he just got that spot, and I'm feeling like, damn, is that Jay trying to you know this is punishment for Wayne? Like I hey, remember. You remember the artist was talking that shit and you know what I mean? So I don't know what it is, but I definitely don't think that Kendrick deserves the spot. Let me know in the comment section if you think that he deserved the spot. You know what I mean? Over Wayne. You gotta think Wayne has been in the game fucking 20 years. Banger after banger after banger. Give me another artist with another catalog full of mixtapes and bodies of work. That's better than Wayne in the rap game. Everybody know Lil Wayne birthed this new generation, the dreads, the tats on the face, the, the motherfucking rock star look. We know who was doing that back in the day. You feel me, bitch and pay. That's all I gotta say. Can't see you little niggas. The money in the way. You know who was doing that rock star bossing up shit. You feel me? Wayne. You know what I mean? So it's only right when you go to a place like New Orleans that's full of legends. You got you you don't even just got Wayne. You got the Cash Money Army. You got motherfucking Master P, them soldiers. Uh -huh. you feel me? You got Boosy Boo. You got you got you even got Young Boy for the newer generation. But you pick somebody that's not even from 
the area that don't resonate with the people like their own that didn't come up from what we came up from with Katrina and all that. And I think that the only right artist would be to put Wayne on there. We got to get some of them cash money artists. We need P out there. We need him out there. Who do you? We need that in the stands. Get them turned up for the game. You know what I mean? And I just think Kendrick Lamar, it's going to be a great performance, but I don't think it's going to bring the energy, and it can't bring the energy that a show like that will ever do. Now, do I think that Kendrick is going to uh, pull, pull Wayne in the game? I definitely think so. I definitely think so, but in the end, we all know it was like a, but it was Kendrick's show, though. It wasn't even Wayne's show like that. So it's a little bit different. That's why I'm looking at it like, how could you fumble the rock like that? I'm sure even the players know, like, we gonna be playing in New Orleans for the biggest game of the year, and Wayne ain't gonna be performing? That's crazy. That's crazy, you feel me? But again, let me know in the comment section what y'all think. Am I tripping? Is Not Like Us the biggest song right now, so he deserved that spot, you know what I mean? Like I said, we know who that song was about, so we know whose artist that is. Is it punishment for my man Wheezy Wee? Or was it just like a, hey, this is a, you know what I mean? Maybe next year Kendrick can perform her, you know what I mean? Like, but when you in New Orleans and, and you got a goat that live, he's live, effect still performing, he's here with us. Don't give it to a nigga off a couple hit records when a nigga like Wayne been giving you consistency for 20 years. Who is the biggest artist? You feel me? His name might not be with the newer like rap listeners and stuff like that, that he might not be on No Jumper and stuff like that. But when you think of who is the GOAT, you know who the GOAT is. So I don't even got to keep this conversation going. So like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and let your boy know if you if you think that Wayne deserved a spot and if you think Kendrick going, you know, just, just pull a heave hole and pull him in the game and let him perform and shit like that. And let me think if, even if you don't want Wayne to perform, if you think like, shit, we rather hear Kendrick. Let me know in the comment section. I'm about to get out of here. So again, like, share, subscribe, and you already know who it is. It's Jolin, it's Varsity. Peace.